hashtag I'm Lane Dubin. Hey, it's Alex Kendall. SPB recently held an event for all QU students to go to the Big E this past weekend. So as everyone knows, the best part about the Big E is the food, and we got a lot of food, especially from the state houses. Lane, what kind of food did you get? Yeah, so I got the mac and cheese um, in New Hampshire, and I was in, it was at Zach's Mac and Cheese, and I have my own little scale where I rate my mac and cheeses. And so I was like, I need to add this to my list. So I tried their mac and cheese. They literally had a whole mac and cheese line that I had to wait in. <laughs> so um, many lines. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, but it was really good. They claim to be the best New Hampshire, and I'm going to give it to them. What's the rating? Rating, I gave it a solid four out of five. Fair. I would say the best thing that I had was from Maine. I got one of the iconic Maine baked potatoes. And I also had to go to the side place to get some bacon because they were running out of bacon, but still worth it. Got two nice hefty baked potatoes, which were really good. But of course there isn't just food at the Big E. There's also a bunch of different kinds of vendors and entertainment that they have there. So for the entertainment side, there were a lot of bands and a lot of people playing instruments and everything. There was not a lot of people playing when we were there, but a lot of them do play at the nighttime. We were also there on the last day, but it was some live music depending on like where you went. And you could see that there were some stages that were set up and they were all ready for the nighttime. And that was definitely a big thing. Yeah, that was really exciting. But I think another really big part of the Big E that was also a lot of fun was the carnival side. But I bet the one thing that we wish we could have gone on was the Ferris wheel. They had this big Ferris wheel with a huge ticket line to go on it. But something we were able to see was a bunch of farm animals. Ugh, what did we even see? We saw chicks being hatched. Yes. We saw llamas, alpacas, goats, sheep. sheep. Giant oh, Clydesdale sheep. horses oh, that oh were two, uh, 2,200 pounds. Yeah, they were <laughs> massive. We also saw, which was probably my favorite, a bunch of little piglets and their mom all sleeping together. Yeah, they were absolutely adorable. So there was also a lot of non-food vendors. There was people that were selling jewelry, handmade jewelry, um, glass blowing stuff that was absolutely beautiful works of art. There was even like cutting boards, you name it. They had it. And you know what Alex got from one of the places? Yeah. She got the reversible octopus. I've been wanting one of those for such a long time, and I finally got one thanks to the Big E. So that was pretty cool. Thank you so much, Big E, and yeah. thank you so much to the SPB for holding this event for QU students. Yes. And thank you so much. Bye, hashtag. This is Alex Kendall. And Lane Dubin. Have a good one.